Hi, I'm Jody Shelley, and this is Under Review, presented by Continental Office. And today, our guest is Nick Blankenberg. Thanks for having me. Nick, thanks for being here. You're Under Review. Perfect. So in Nashville, offensive zone. You can see you made a great play there. I'll let you watch this first. Great play on the wall. Thinking defense first, like a good defenseman, and then... How good did that feel? I think that that game might have been one of the, I mean, probably one of the most like fun I've ever had playing hockey. Really? So I think I've watched that clip probably, I can't even count how many times. Really? But, um, that was a pretty special moment for me, so it was pretty cool. What do you see at this play here as this puck is coming through the middle of the ice? Yeah, well, Rosie's, uh, Rosie's in a good position, F3. Uh, we got two guys backtracking, and I mean, at that point, it's basically a two on two, on two if, if they do get possession. So. Uh, minute 28 left in the game, tie game, just kind of thinking a little bit more defensively. And then uh, basically once, once Jakey has the puck, I, I kind of know I can jump on the play a little bit. And um, I don't know, I'm just kind of trying to find open space right now at this point with where he's at. And um, either if he's giving it to Z and, and Z's getting it on net, I'm, I'm crashing the net. Or um, obviously Jakey makes a great play coming up here. So. Well, the great thing here is all five defenders are watching the puck. So your awareness is is right on point and you see you know you got Zach there right yeah so off you go once he opens up basically about a second before that I kind of knew it was on and what about the shot what do you see here I mean I think I think everyone thought I was I was going glove side high but I kind of noticed he was sliding over a little bit too much so honestly maybe just a lucky shot I don't think I've ever ever scored a goal like that before and putting it kind of low low blocker like that in that angle so I think he just maybe slid over too much or or whatnot, but um, honestly, at that at that point, I, I blacked I blacked out. I blacked out. So, all right, this is well, same game. Oh yes, nice goal by Johnny. What a play by you, though. That might be my favorite play of the year. <laughs> to be honest with you. Okay, so you guys are shorthanded. It becomes five on five. I kind of, I kind of saw he was on an island over there. I think that who was that, Johansson. So you, you see that he's all by himself. You're starting to turn over. Yeah. To play that puck. For me personally, I'm trying to eliminate time and space, obviously too. But try and use my speed and be able to kind of pinch him off with an angle. And I kind of see when he, when he fumbles, fumbles it. I just trying to get a stick on it. And luckily, uh, hits my stick, and I was able to gain possession. And then um, kind of saw Johnny out of the corner of my eye there. Like where? I don't see where. Okay, right so there. as you turn. So right there, I kind of see the pucks right in front of me. I see Johnny's kind of standing at the blue, and if I make that pass 10 times, I don't know if I'm putting, <laughs> yeah. it, putting it on his that tape every, every time that quick. But, um, but yeah, no, that was a good play by him and good awareness. Great battle by you and excellent awareness. And then to execute that play, uh, well done. You know what I love about your game, though, too? You do everything hard. Pass hard, skate hard. That was a pretty big hit. There's another angle right there, though. <laughs> okay, here you are behind the net. You're in full control of the play. Doesn't go well, so now you've got to adjust, right? Oh. I think for me, just in general, it goes back to um, the better gaps I can have. And the, I guess the more work I put in trying to get up ice, the easier it is for me to, to be able to play aggressive on, um, in situations like that. Like if I wouldn't have been able to get up ice so quick, I probably would have had to open up and start skating backwards and then it would have been on a one-on-one -on -one. compared to there I was able to take away time and space and um, luckily break up the play yeah break up the play in a big way if the player isn't if the player is far away from you you change that immediately you, you do a good job of getting that yeah gap you try and gap up and um, yeah I mean I think it goes back to taking away time and space and um, just trying to get up ice whether if that's obviously if they have possession or if we have possession too and how about the physical play? I think I've always kind of had that chip on my shoulder growing up and being the youngest, uh, having an older brother too. I think that, that definitely has helped out a little bit. And, and I, like I mean, it's fun, it's fun to play like that. Credit too. the older brother. Yeah. Always. All right, Nick. Well, thanks for your time. Yeah. Well, thanks. I appreciate it. That, was, that was awesome. That was Under Review presented by Continental Office. Nick Blankenberg. That was outstanding. Thanks for your time. Yeah. Thank you.